I'm not backing off either. We're gonna try it. Oh shit, this man's on the side. No way, that was epic, man. <laughs> What a slap train. Welcome back, guys. Forza Motorsport 6 is here back again for another episode, man. Now, since I've been gone, uh, we have forgot about the Mobile One car pack that came out a little while ago. Now, one of these cars is what you're looking at right here, man. The 1988 Holden VL Commodore Group ASV. Now, we have already upgraded this car, and I wanted to ask the question today can we drift? with drag tires now obviously the answer that it should be is no right i mean that's that's the obvious answer i mean the drag tires are supposed to be meant for drag racing but i wanted to put it to the test and almost kind of uh myth bust it if you will now obviously as i said this thing is already built not too much though i mean i didn't want to go over and you know just have a stupid amount of horsepower so in the final product for this holding it's 364 horsepower on the stock motor. Now, obviously, this thing is a pretty damn big bitch on its own. A lot of damn body kit on here, a lot of arrow. And personally, I love the way this thing looks. And obviously, it's not meant to go sideways, but it's Forza Motorsport 6, man. We're gonna do what we wanna do, and that is getting sideways. Now, it is an A-Class 611, five liter V8, 394 foot-pounds of torque, and weighing in at 2,487 pounds. Long story short, she'll move, man. It's not bad at all. Now, we do have street tires on this car right now, just as a base design. 225s in the front, 235s in the rear, and SA97F rims on this thing. Personally, I love the way this thing looks. I really do. Some of you guys may not like the excessive spoiler, but I mean, like I said, it's something that really draws me into a lot of cars. It's just over-the-top modifications. Um, I was reading that most of it is plastic, though, but it does actually offer, I think, 25% more downforce than the original design. So that's pretty cool seeing that it actually does do something. Now, we're going to try to get a little bit sideways with this before we throw on the drag tires and see what happens if she'll even slide. Now, I'm pretty sure she will. I mean, this V8 is just throwing this thing around, no problems at all. Gear ratios may need to be worked out just a bit. Oh yeah, look at that. Keep in mind, stock tuning on this right now. We have not done anything to this, and I think we should right now just to see how it goes. We're actually going to take the drag tires online and see if they can compete against the pack. I don't know, man. I mean, it's going to be interesting to see, um, you know, how they do. Personally, I'm going to say, and I've been told, that a set of Corsa has something called junk tires. Now, uh, junk tires may or may not be in our favor for this, but that's what I was told that it kind of compares to. We will see, but once we put this differential kind of high, it actually, it actually holds not bad. Okay, okay, I see you, man, I see you. I think I'm a fan, but we got to make this thing what we're supposed to be doing, and that is the drag build. So we're going to go ahead, bring it back to the upgrade shop, and see what we can do. Now, I'm hoping, man, this is my hopes and dreams for Christmas, is that Forza Horizon 2 puts out a snow update. Um, highly doubtful, but just imagine how that would be for winter man i would be absolutely in love if they did something like that man it would just be absolutely crazy drag tire compound special tire compound optimized specifically for drag racing so we're gonna go ahead and throw this on ten thousand dollars it's actually gonna lower our pi as well too so it's gonna be absolutely terrible um i'm gonna go ahead just because i think that we're gonna need it we're gonna go ahead and increase the tire width to 285 on the rear and then 235s on the front. They're big, thick tires, man. I don't know if we're gonna need them, but uh, I'm down to see if it's even possible. I mean, 
I don't know. Leave me your thoughts before actually going into this and let me know what you think is going to happen. Personally, I don't know, man. I don't know. I think we're going to be able to slide. It's just going to be really consistent of uh, throttle control. And if, you know, we're easy on the throttle, we should be able to hold it out. Maybe we can't hold it out at all, but... Nonetheless, though, we're bringing this online to a actual Ribble Drive only lobby, and we're going to see how these tires go, man. I mean, I, I, I don't know, man. I don't know. Alright, actually, holy shit, man. The grip is crazy. I couldn't even spin him. Obviously, they are very grippy. They're drag tires, but shit, man. There we go. Okay. So, my original kind of predicament was going to be that it was going to be very, very slippery, which it is. I mean, you can see this thing is just sliding right now. And that's kind of why I wanted the Top Gear track, just to see, you know, how it feels, but... It's not bad though, man. Holy shit. Okay. We'll go around this. Kind of come back in. Yep. Okay, okay. A little bit oversteer on that, but I mean, for the most part though, it's doable, man. I did not think that the drag tires were going to be doable for any type of drifting at all. I thought they were just going to be, you know, really slippery, and that was about it, but. That seems to be the complete opposite case. As long as you got some good brakes. I mean, right there, she'll slide for days. It's just a matter of making sure that you can control this. Isn't going to be good. Oh, shit. We got it, though, man. This was meant to be. Right here. Just a smoke show, man. I meant to do that. I'm just kidding. I meant to do that. All right. So, let's go ahead and try to set this up. Final tune is as follows. Um, the markers are still set for the original placing. So you guys can kind of see where they started off and ended off. Pretty much just kind of loosened up the suspension a little bit. Um, I think it's going to be a little bit better. We did throw on some negative rear camber as well as the front just to see how it's going to react. Um, as well too, we did stretch the gears, or sorry, we didn't stretch them. We compressed the gears quite a bit and the tire pressure we did bring down to a 26.5. I don't know how this is going to go. Um, we're going to see and then we're going to find out if this is going to be even any competition in an online server, man. I don't know. It's going to be nuts. Look at this slide though. The slide is so crazy, man. It just literally just slides. I think this is the only time that I've actually put on drag tires. And I know you guys may be thinking, Slab, what the hell is this damn video, man? What do you think? Can you drift with damn drag tires? I didn't know, man. I just, first time ever throwing on drag tires. So it was something a little bit different to me. Something that I wanted to try out. And personally, it's not bad, man. It's not bad. If you guys have driven with drag tires on, let me know your thoughts. If you do it often, uh, let me know what your usual setup is that you run. But for the most part, though, it's not bad. As long as you have a good kind of braking balance and pressure, so you're not kind of, you know, making the car go a little bit unstable underneath heavy braking. Um, this works. It really does. I'm going to see how it feels with 900 degrees of rotation on this just to see, man. I just want to see. Oh, yeah, we stalled it. Okay, okay. Now, 900 I've never liked. You know, the actual center point of the wheel is so weird that, you know, it makes everything not feel proper on 900. You always have to try to, you know, push it back over to the center point. It's just, it's a very weird... Oh, shit. We're not going to do the 900, man. I just... I'm not a fan of 900 on this game whatsoever, but I am a fan of online lobbies, and that is where we're going. Ladies and gentlemen, I will see you guys online, man. Look at that. That's clean, man. It's real clean. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are on Indianapolis Motor Speedway right now. Uh, our Commodore, as I said, has drag tires on here, but um, I'm actually thinking right now, maybe I shouldn't have thrown those massive 285s on the rear of this thing. I'm thinking maybe like a 265 would have been perfect. It's too late now, man. We can't do a damn thing about it. But, you know, I wanted to make sure that I had somewhat a little bit of traction with these sticky drag tires. And I mean, like I said, 
I've never used them before. So if you guys are saying, oh my god, Slab, how'd you not think that the drag tires were going to be sticky and not slippery? Well, you know, I just figured, you know, they're not meant to be going sideways and stuff like that, right? So that's where I kind of thought that they were going to be really kind of slippery in the corners, which they are. I mean, you slide for days, but um, they are a lot stickier than I originally attended. Obviously, I know this. Drag tires are sticky. I, I fully understand that shit. It's just a matter of, you know, I thought the correlation in the game was that they were going to be a little bit slipperier. That's all I'm saying, man. That's it. Here we go, though. It's game time right now, ladies and gentlemen. Here, oh, my God. Holy shit. It's crazy. We got a Volvo going sideways up here. This man is in an F1 car. I don't know what's going on. This is some ridiculous shit. We're going to try it. Yep. I can't let go of my e-brake, man. I gotta get my finger back. And that's a negative on that shit. Oh my goodness. What does it matter with this lobby? Why is everybody driving some stupid shit? As I'm driving a damn drag tire. Oh my God. I'm just gonna stop right there. Here we go. Third gear is actually pretty damn solid for this. I need the wheel spin, is that's really what it comes down to. Oh, don't lose it. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, just damn straight under steer, man. Oh my goodness. That man's gone on that stress. Holy shit. We're trying to dump. You know we have to. And of course, they're gonna, okay. They really need to fix that reverse entry shit, man. Oh, my bad, my bad, man, my bad. That plastic got you on that. It's a very different experience though with drag tires. And I mean, like I said, uh, totally threw me a curveball when I was getting a shit ton of grip on this. Just a matter of it slides in the corners is really what it is. We're gonna try this high speed fifth gear. Oh shit, never mind. We're just gonna go under steer fifth gear, man. Look at this! Fix it! God damn! That man is lucky I did not take him out. I was so tempted, man. So tempted. Oh shit. bad it is definitely something that um, does need some work but once you get it sideways though I mean just like this it is a beast man Woo! I can't believe this man's actually drifting this shit in front of us though oh Tom man I'm sorry bro. I'm sorry The only thing is that the understeer is so real until you hit that e-brake and oh my goodness like the understeer is crazy man as long as you as long as you actually get the rear end out you're good but if you don't get that rear end out before this corner um, it is gonna be a tough time I followed that man's line and that was a bad idea damn F1 car inbound man son of a jit But the main thing is, though, that we are sliding. So the question of the day, like I said, can you drift with drag tires? The answer is yes, you can. Man. And honestly, it's not bad. Obviously, it's not the most stable. But, I mean, we're able to get a little bit closer to that man's door. I'm not backing off either. We're going to try it. Oh, shit. This man's on the side. No way. That was epic, man. Let's go, baby. See you later, DK. Take care, my dude. All right, we're going to try to get this done here properly, man. Come on, baby. Work with me on this. Oh, shit. I think we got it. Why? Why did I drop the clutch on... Oh, my God. I should have waited. 
I knew it, man. As soon as I did it, I'm like, shit, it's too early. But I thought I was going to be sliding a little bit more than that. That was the other reason. We're in seventh place. I just noticed that. Actually, six now, man. This is crazy. Oh, no. No, you did it right now. Okay, we're good. Sorry about that, DK. I'm sorry, my man. Jesus. You guys like that GoPro sticker, man? I thought it was pretty cool. I actually looked quite a long time for this uh, actual vinyl on the storefront. And I was looking. I didn't really see anything that really kind of, you know, made me go, oh, shit. And then I came across this one. And I'm like, damn, man. That's a nice damn design. So I figured I would throw it in. But if you guys were wanting to slap, why do you have that GoPro on there, man? I just liked it. I just liked it. Come on, baby. Try and gain up to third place. If, oh, my goodness. We got a damn. Okay. Not bad, man. Not bad at all. We have a race car with drag tires on this build for today. I mean, this is just... I don't even know, man. I don't know. This is what happens when you've been playing too much damn Forza, though. And you start needing things to do, man. You know what I'm saying? Shit. This guy's not passing me. I will put him in the wall this time. Yeah. Don't bring that shit in here, my man. Wait. How the... Okay. I guess this man pulled that out somehow. I don't know how he just did that, but it worked. And yeah. So why is this thing no wheel spin? He's probably gonna be so upset at me for doing that, man. He's probably holding some notes or some shit. Oh my god. That scared me. This lobby though is straight just I don't even know, man. It's doo-doo is what it is. I mean, there is just a whole slew of people in here that are just doing some crazy shit. I mean, we got a wagon, we got an F1 car, we have a hold it with drag tires. I mean, the only damn car that should be in here is that damn 350 up there. That's about it. Oh, I'm so sorry, Fuzzy Fletch. I'm sorry, my dude. I didn't mean to. As I keep hitting them, man. My bad, my bad. Come on, baby. That man's not pulling a bag. It doesn't. Oh, James, Jesus. Come on, man. Things have got to be quicker. Okay. Now I've seen everything, man. We were on that damn F1 car's back bumper on that shit. Oh, there's no way he saved. Oh, he saved it. Come on, man. And the, okay, there's a Ford F100 truck. That's cool. Excuse me. And he, he disappeared. Like, what was that? Was that a ghost? What is the matter with this damn lobby today, guys? I don't know, man. Three seconds. I as well do something crazy, right? I mean, we'll do a 360. Holy shit! I don't know what happened. I think I've done. Too much Forza today is what it is because cars are disappearing. We're getting door to door with F1 cars, with damn Volvo. Oh my Jesus. Ladies and gentlemen, the question, like I said, can we drift with drag tires? That is confirmed. You can do that. Is it the most used tire compound? Hell no, man. I would not recommend it. Um, but I will say, though, with the amount of you know tire width, the proper tuning, you can actually get some tandems going if you really wanted to that's your cup of tea you know what i'm saying so ladies and gentlemen big thank you for coming around today for some more forza motorsport 6 we got disconnected from that lobby actually it said no no, no sir you're not using drag tires again in this shit all right we're gonna kick your ass out of here but uh that is it for today if you guys did enjoy it don't forget to subscribe become a member of team slap today and start spinning some damn rubber with us you guys can also follow me on facebook instagram and twitter all of which are found in the description box down below to Motor Slab Train, Forza Motorsport 6, I'm out. Peace. Oh my god, what is going on everybody at Jabota Slab Train and welcome back guys.
Oh.